you, is it? I thought I'd rid the place of enemies while enjoying a stroll. Perfect timing. There is something I require your help with. I would like to ask you about the relationship we will be building between Ratem and Aelio. Now that we will be cooperating, it would be proper for us to learn more about each other. I am not very familiar with the ways of Aelio, however. Other than military affairs, I know little of its culture and customs. As we are personally acquainted, I thought I could practice some cultural exchange with you. Come now, don't worry. Nothing more difficult than some simple conversation, just as we are doing now. What do you think? Is that so? Very good then. With Manon, I have had some exchanges about technological matters and the like. But I have not had much opportunity to speak with Ina. How should I phrase this? There are not many in Ritem with a temperament such as hers. I find myself at a loss as to how to start a conversation. How do you usually interact with her? What are her interests, for example? Mind singing? Hmm. I suppose I could talk about that. I see. This has been useful. My thanks. Do you have a moment now? I'd like to know more about you as well. Let me see. What shall I ask? You, is it? <laughs> you are quite skilled at making yourself invisible. Impressive. Practicing? Yes, well, I suppose you could call it that. It is my dance lesson. I say lesson, but I no longer have a teacher. My family's gift is the power of song. But that power is not derived from singing alone. Only when song and dance combine as one does the true power manifest. That is what my mother always taught me. Singing aside, 
dance has always been a weak point of mine. Oh, how my mother used to scold me during my lessons. When I stopped singing in front of others, I stopped dancing as well. Now that I am singing publicly again, however, I can no longer neglect my dancing. And so I make the time to train myself daily in the art of dance. But having said that, however... I still find it difficult to be watched. If my dancing skills were a little more polished, I could perform for you and ask for your feedback. Or, perhaps you could dance with me. I was only teasing. Before I can reveal my song and dance, I need to be certain that I've mastered them first. When that time comes, I want you to be there. Goodbye now. Oh, and no more peeping from behind boulders. It was an arduous battle. Of course, it's not over yet. But at the very least, we've reached a major milestone. In this seemingly endless battle against Renis Ratem, so many have given their lives in this struggle. If we had continued to fight on, alone, without accepting your help. I have no doubt we would have been defeated. The people of Ratem have long relied on their own strength alone to solve their problems. We asked for help from no one. We were proudly self-sufficient. It was always thought that that was best. land covered in sand and surrounded by mountains cut off from the outside world our perspective became limited as well when the three of you arrived here many of our people viewed you with little but skepticism Some even suggested that joining together with you in battle would dishonor us. 
In truth, it was because of these opinions of my people that I refused your offer at first. When I look back on it, such pride was foolish. You helped us realize the error of our thinking. You came to this faraway land and proved that your methods are effective. Seeing this, Jalil and Mosin had a change of heart. And in truth, so did I. Allow me to offer you my gratitude once again. I cannot thank you enough for rescuing Ratem from this danger. <laughs> there is truth in that. Every single time I come here, I always feel such a deep sense of shame. That feeling has not changed. But at least now I can tell them that they are finally victorious. The struggles of our predecessors have made us what we are today. And in the end, victory is ours. I can tell them that their deaths were not in vain. And the emotions I feel when I sing have begun to transform as well. By the way, there is something I have been meaning to ask you. How did it come to be that Manon knew the Song of Mourning? It is true that it has been passed down in my family for generations. It is also well known amongst my people. Perhaps it is not unreasonable that she may have heard it somewhere. Well, we've chatted at length. That's enough for now, I think. Why don't we pay our respects together? <laughs>